everyone. It's day six of my social media and online careers guide. My name is Anne, or Anne Christine, for if you want the long version. <laughs> I help women entrepreneurs, podcasters, and authors through social media syndication and marketing automation so they can uh, exceptionally establish their brand, expand their following, and grow their business exponentially. The question for today's Facebook and Instagram live is how to find your niche and how to add value to your clients. So let's go to the first one, finding niche. Ako kasi early on my online careers, nalaman ko yung niche na gusto ko, which is social media marketing, nung nagkaroon na ako ng client sa social media. Uh, I remember yung when I was building my online portfolio, not all tutorials or yung step-by-step -step, um, instructions for a specific tool or software or website that I did were 100% about social media. I remember there's how, there's how to use Hootsuite and Pinterest and uh, but I can't remember the rest but definitely hindi sila social media. So I found out my niche, the type, the skill, the niche na gusto kong gawin nung nagtatrabaho na ako for my one of my very first clients. So she got she took me in as a social media manager. I was managing her Facebook, Twitter, LinkedIn, Facebook Twitter. Um, Google Plus, those four, uh, those four, <laughs> those four social media platforms. And this was way back 2009 or 2000, 2011, I think, or 2012. So when I was doing the work for her, kahit na uh, ginagawa ko yun as part-time, nagpapahinga lang ako ng konti coming from the, my day work, and then I'm going to, I'm going to, um, do it uh, 8 or 9 p.m. It doesn't feel like work for me. I was having fun. And so it was then that I realized I love doing this. I love sharing stuff. So that's a good thing. Now, um, a few years later, your mentor, ko, si Jomar Hilario, he was able to um, find out how to identify your niche, niche as early as um, you're in you're the beginning of your online career. And that is by knowing and understanding your DISC or DISC profile. I can give you a link on um, the, pers the personality uh, test. It's one of the many, but um, I found out that the DISC profile, it was actually by Tony Robbins. It's one of the most accurate and re, um, not inaccurate in sense na so, sobrang comprehensive and detailed niya. And, um, syempre kung ano yung lumabas sa quiz, it's all about you. Kasi ikaw lang naman yung sasagot noon, no? Alam kapit, alam kapit, kapit ba kayo yung sumagot. So, that's the easiest uh, way now. Uh, if you're just beginning this and you are in a limbo, anong niche ka mag, um, anong niche ka mag, uh, anong, uh, uh, isa-serve mo sa clients. And, uh, syempre, if, if you're someone who hasn't gotten any client yet kasi you're still a newbie, so, knowing your disk profile is very handy. So, I can give you the link under the comment thread later on after the live is done. And, um, yeah, you can, you can go from there. You can go from there. Second topic is about um, adding value, how to add value to your clients. If you have already found your niche and you love what you're doing and you think you can still add more, what do you, uh, what do you do? So, salamat sa nagbibigay ng hearts. <laughs> Yay! Sa Facebook Live. So, the first one, um, I, 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 I have two things in terms of adding value to, to clients. The first one is your attitude towards work. Very important. Um, uunahin ko na to kasi importante yan. Kahit ang tao, 
kahit siya na yung sa tingin niyo pinakamagaling sa social media or sa Facebook ads or sa landing page or sa email automation, kung hindi kung kung meron siyang attitude na hindi maganda, itatapon mo yung alam niya. Kasi mahirap pakisamahan yung taong marunong lang. Hindi yung mas maganda yung sa e. Hindi ko alam sa Tagalog yun eh. Pero um, sa, in English, um, iba yung educated sa learned. Yan. So, I would start from there. Um, the attitude towards work. Um, for example, if you're if you're someone that uh, before, um, kung ano lang yung paggawa ng client, yun lang ang gagawin, um, a level up of that attitude could be Initiat uh, have the initiative. You can talk it. Um, hindi. Wait. Um, tama nga dito. Alika. Alika. Na buksan mo. Wow. Alika. <laughs> this is my dad. Tito ka di ka makita ng camera. Ang weird. Hi. Siya. Um, me and you. Siya. Hindi. Ako nga. Ano kung kita mo, di ba? So that's ayan you 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 stare at that there and here stay you stare here so hi oh hi uh I'm doing Facebook live so you're seen all over the internet whoever is watching this Sheila saying hi hello there hello Thai there ah uh, <laughs> Sheila 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 ah uh, he she met you on pictures so. There, as I was saying, so your attitude, yeah. Um, you can instead of, for example, um, before kano lang pagawa sa yon, yun lang, and then tapos na. Maybe try doing asking, um, having an initiative. Do you, um, do you think, do you think may gusto ko pang pagawa? Bye. Meron din tingin mo ba may may pay may mayroong kapang kaya ng gawin na kailangan ng client mo? So that's an example. Um, the second one is, of course, about skills. If you are, if you're an experienced uh, uh, online professional like me, um, along the way, aside from the social media skills that I learned, studied, and applied, lahat lahat na, um, I was able to find out my role as a social media manager and. Uh, in my journey, I found out that you know, um, social media is a party, and if you'd like to talk to people better, so they would know about your service, product, or brand, you bring them to your email. You you uh, you um, find a way to for for your target audience to give you you to give you their email address. So I uh, I. I found out about it. It's so, like, interesting yun. Um, kasi people will get more engaged if they're on um, their email. So, I started learning about email marketing. And of course, pag sa email marketing, you, you type stories there and um, um, you, 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 it, it entails writing in short. So, I had to learn, I had to relearn storytelling because way back in college, pa yung skill na yun. And at the same time, I had to learn a bit of copywriting. So, unti-unti, kasi hindi naman siya overnight. So, there, that one. Uh, so, right now, uh, I know social media. And at the same time, I can also serve email marketing uh, sequences, autoresponders, and uh, five weekly newsletters to my clients. Pwede yun. So, yun. Siyempre, I... Um, Nalaman ko na pwede kong gawin yun. Pero of course, I also had to ask myself who I love doing that. And I, I write. I e-write my, I email my my subscribers once a week. So, it's something that I also would like to do. So, there you go. At the same time, um, nakapag-aral din ako ng Facebook ads. Kasi it was opened around four, three, uh, four, five years ago. And I started learning about Facebook ads in 2014. So, Ngayon, dahil uh, I'm already offering it to my clients as part of my uh, business services to them. So, aside from social media, I also do Facebook ads for them. So, that's how I added value to my clients. 
So those two, um, again, um, for you to add value, um, think about your attitude towards work. Maybe it needs a little rework or i-amp natin ang konti. And then the second one is, based on your skills, what do you think you could still do? So, kasi uh, with number two, um, especially kapag um, you're an experienced online professional already, you will find out other skills na you will realize, kaya ko tong gawin, kaya ko tong pag-aralan. Now, what if you are still uh, um, newbie on this, uh, on online careers? Again, I would still go back to the DISC. Um, you would be able to identify. Pag na-identify mo yung personality mo, doon mo malalaman yung mga skills na gusto mong gawin. Di lang naman isa yan, marami yan. Napakarami yung trabaho sa internet. Ang daming opportunity. So, it's up to you to find out um, what it is, how it is, and who could help you um, uh, on, on achieving those. There you have it. My day six of social media and online careers guide. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you soon.